So what does this all mean for the future of MPS? JS On Air, we're joined by Alan Borsick of the Milwaukee Journal Sentinel. He was at the MPS board meeting last night and actually broke the story. Thanks for joining us, Alan. Boy, big story today. <laughs> it frankly caught me by surprise. <laughs> what does this all mean? Can you break it down for us a little bit? Well, as a practical matter, specifically as far as uh, dissolving the district, nobody knows what it means. Um, but as a practical political matter, I think it turns up the temperature on the whole issue of what to do about the future of MPS quite sharply. Uh, it certainly got the interest of the governor's office, the mayor's office, and lots of other people today. And it comes at a time when the system's under enormous pressure. So I guess one of the questions you have to ask is, is it legal? We've heard from somebody from the state saying, I don't think so. You it's, need actually something from the legislature first. It's not legal under law as it stands now, uh, as it applies to the city of Milwaukee. But I'm not sure how big a deal that is, because I think in any case, if something happened, it would have to go to the state legislature. And the legislature could change the law. The legis legislature could change the whole structure of MPS uh, if that came to pass. Nothing's going to happen real fast, I'm sure of that. Alan, this is a major decision that we're talking about that impacts lots of students and their parents. Is there precedent for this in other cities in our state? The issue of, of dissolving the school district has come up a couple times in the last few years. In fact, it's underway currently in a small district in northeastern Wisconsin, Wazaki. Um, it has, it has, actually hasn't happened, and usually there's some way they found to get out of it. But uh, districts statewide are under enormous financial pressure. Milwaukee's the biggest and certainly going to take the spotlight here. Yeah, a lot to come on this. Alan Borsick, thank you so much for your insight on all this. Glad and you here. can read more about it at jsonline.com. We have a link on our website, todaystmj4.com.